Hi, this is Nick on the 16th of May. Just want to tell you a little story about uh, something amazing that happened once when I showed up. But the bigger idea here is we'd never know what's waiting for us when we choose to show up. You know, and often in my experience, we need to show up in the face of our resistance. You know, there, that's often when the, the good stuff happens too. When we, we don't feel inclined to show up and we choose to, that's when good stuff can happen. And of course, sometimes we show up and nothing major or significant seems to happen. But here's a story of, of something that happened to me probably about 14 years ago now. Uh, I was living in Tottenham at the time in North London and I've been invited to go and give a talk at the uh, Alexander Palace, uh, which is in North London, you probably know, is the, the home of broadcasting. The first uh, television broadcast was from Alexander Palace. So I've been invited to give a talk at the Organic Food and Wine Show in the September uh, of that year, and this was back in the June, and I, I kind of said yes to it. But then I'd heard from friends that the show probably wasn't going to be that well attended because uh, it hadn't been very well marketed, and my talk was just a half hour talk, you know, a free talk, I wasn't being paid for it, uh, about half an hour after it opened. So as the day approached, I became more and more resistant to going and giving this talk. I thought, what's the point? You know, it's only a couple of miles away from where I live. And when the day arrived, the weather was horrible, it was raining, and part of me went, why, do, why am I bothering? You know, this could be a glorious waste of time here. But I thought, no, I'm a professional. I've made a commitment to give this talk. Let me go and give this talk. So I went there and um, you know went to find where I was giving my talk and there wasn't a place to give my talk it, I was giving a talk amongst the stands that were there and Barmy was just going my god this is even worse than I thought it was so when I started giving my talk there was uh, about three people and a dog there uh, and luckily by the time I finished giving my talk uh, there was about 20 people and the dog had wandered off so at least there were more people at the end of my half hour talk and I think I sold one or two books and I was just packing up and thinking well you know I've followed through on my commitment I'll go home now and then somebody came up to me and said may I introduce myself my name's Cherie and then she introduced a gentleman to me and she said you know we were listening to your talk and we really enjoyed it we're here exhibiting and uh, we run a multivitamin and mineral company based in New York State and we have our sales convention every January in uh, California place called Santa Ynez and uh, wondered if you might be interested in coming and giving a, a talk like that to our sales team. So I tried to stifle, you know, too quick a positive response and said, well, I'll just check my diary and see if I'm available. And, um, you know, to cut a long story short, four months later, I was being flown to uh, Santa Barbara Airport in California. I was put up uh, in a, on a 2000 acre ranch. I was paid handsomely for giving a talk for a couple of hours to their sales team. Um, I had a friend who happened to, uh, an American friend who happened to be able to join me there. So I then hung out for several days afterwards in California and we had a fantastic time and planned some projects together. So it was just one of those remarkable things. And, and obviously that doesn't happen every time I show up or any of us show up. But here's the key. I nearly didn't show up to give that talk because I didn't feel inspired to do it. I felt I might just be wasting my time. So I have always kept that experience in my mind as the, the amazing thing that can happen when we choose to show up. We can never tell, you know, sometimes nothing appears to happen, sometimes remarkable things ha happen. But I think the one thing we can guarantee almost pretty much is if we don't show up, probably not much is gonna happen. So that's my thought today is like, where are you being nudged to show up or being invited to show up or could just choose to show up because you've no idea what good things could happen as a result of you showing up. So that's my thought for today. God bless. Have a good day. Bye.